might be asking. I'm in a whole new setting, a whole new house, and I don't think I've actually ever filmed or vlogged in this house, but I'm actually at my mom's. They, for those of you who've been following me for a long time, you know that they have a house in Vermont and that's usually where I go to visit them, but they also built a house recently here in Austin or a little bit outside of Austin, Texas. So it's closer to me now, which is really nice. So I drove up with Arolo and he loves it here because he gets to go outside and he there's just so much more space for him to kind of isn't there be look at him he loves looking outside he loves going outside and he's such a well-behaved cat here i think he's because he has so much more space to wander and so i thought why not try to vlog today even though i don't really have much going on it's freezing outside which is not normal for this time of year in texas today's high is going to be 60 and I was planning to go on a nice trail walk. The neighborhood here has really beautiful trails and spend some time outside, but it's freezing and I didn't pack anything for this weather because I thought it was going to be like in the mid 70s, 80s. Yeah, well, let's see what, what we get up to today. I've already had my matcha, as you guys saw, and I'm going to go make some breakfast. It's 9 a.m. and I'm getting hungry. So let's go make some breakfast. But hello. One of my favorite things about their kitchen is the fridge. Probiotic oat milk cold brew coffee with vanilla. I mean, I love cold brew. I love it with vanilla. Let's see what this tastes like. This doesn't really look that good. Let's, let's do a little taste test, shall we? It's weird, it's like bitter from the coffee. No, it's like tart from the yogurt. I don't know, I don't really like it. There's another one, strawberry hibiscus, which I think I didn't see before. Oh, wait, wait, wait. I'm gonna have this, yeah. I can't believe I, I feel bad wasting it. I'm gonna see if my stepdad likes it because he eats pretty much <laughs> anything. I'm gonna see if he likes it, um, but I think I'm going to. I love Kite Hill, I love that brand for non-dairy goods and I love their dairy-free yogurt so I think we're gonna go with the strawberry. Do you like it? Yeah, really? It's tart. I told you guys. Now I feel I feel like I feel much better. chilly out but it did clear up the sun is out so we'll go walk well look who's made who's made a friend Barolo is that your uncle Hans hi Bubba do you like having a friend I think that might be a cat who is what is that hey B come come on it's such a beautiful day outside let's go outside come on he wants food, but look at this beautiful day. So happy I woke up and it was gloomy and misty and foggy. It's, a, it's chilly, but I'd rather it be chilly and sunny than chilly and gloomy. So my stepdad and I walked about two and a half miles. Actually, I mean, 
just to let you guys, just to kind of update you guys why I'm here. I love to come and travel, and I love to come and visit them whenever I can. Granted, they're only three hours away from us now, but my mom just had surgery last week on her foot. She needs help around the house, so I offered to come and stay and help around a little bit, and also it's just really nice to be. I love their home, and I love being outside, and uh, yeah, so. I'm going to shower and get ready, and I think we're gonna go out to lunch. So, kitchen with you guys a little later. Does anyone's cat, I know I've said this in my vlogs before where Bedardo is drinking water, I'm using his paw to invisibly pa paddle the water, I don't know. Now he's doing it on the sink. How are you getting on with your scooter? What is it called? It's a, a knee scooter. A knee scooter? <laughs> How are you gonna turn it around? I don't know. Ladies and gentlemen, her. <laughs> Yay! You behave, okay? You gonna be a good boy? Bye. An amazing lunch. We went to this macrobiotic vegan restaurant, but it's it's like a center, right? What, what would you call it? A spiritual meditation. Yeah, healing. like a spiritual meditation healing center that has a cute little bungalow. It, it looked like a retreat. It was really cool. If you're in Austin, and interested, it's called Casa de Luz. Really good. Had a delicious macrobiotic hearty meal, and then we went to Target. I had to get a new phone case. My mom had to get some stuff too. <laughs> Wheeling around, scootering around. And that scooter, whenever you reverse, it's like beep, beep. And you're like, have you ever, have you ever ri ridden one of those before? One. And now we're just enjoying some vitamin D while we can with, with the cats outside. There's my mom's cat, Hans, and then Barolo there. And then my mom with her boot. <laughs> Barolo. Barolo's in his element. He loves it and he doesn't really like go far. It's such a beautiful day. Oh. phone case because I think this one I've had the same one for like the last year and a half or so and the phone case like completely broke and since I use my phone so much for work and personal matters I just needed a new phone case also because it was like just wonky and then my pop socket kind of broke a little bit so I got a new phone case just like a plain black leopard type with a giant little pop socket that I definitely put on like cattywampus. Like there's so much more side, like room here than there is here, but whatever. Yeah, it's like definitely cattywampus, but get the job done, right? I wanted to go for all black this time. It's cute, it's cute. It's cool, it's cool. All right, I think I'm gonna put some comfy clothes on and go join my mom on the couch and just have, it's, what time is it? It's already four, so I think 
I'm gonna bring my book into that room and read and just kind of chill for the rest of the afternoon. All right guys, it's almost six. It's about a quarter to six and that means it's happy hour. So I'm gonna make us some spritzes, some Aperol spritzes. So already got our glasses out. Got Aperol. The only Prosecco that we have, Rosé, still good. All right, so I got two wine glasses filled with ice. Now it's time to open up. club soda or sparkling water really. Does it need anything? Oh, it's good. It's good? Cheese. Yes, it is delicious. Alright, now it's time to play backgammon. People watching? What? So that means that you go. My turn. Finishing the game strong one. with double sixes. It's one to one. How many of you know how to play backgammon? Let me know down below in the comments. Plant-based bacon, y'all. Browns. This is the brand of the plant-based bacon. I've actually never had it, but it looks really good. Black beans, sourdough, toast, avocado, hash browns, and the plant-based bacon. Ciao, friends. Buonasera. Oh, hey, Barolo. Thank you for getting in my frame. It's already Sunday night. I didn't vlog at all today. I vlogged breakfast. And then that's about it because we didn't really do much. Um, we're back in Houston, as you can see. After breakfast, we went on a long walk and then honestly just chilled on the couch and spent, hung out, spent some time outside in the sunshine. And then we got in the car and we just got back home. It's almost eight. Emilio's making dinner. Surprise, surprise, pasta. And I kind of wanted to just conclude this. I don't know. I don't even know how much I filmed yesterday, to be honest, but I feel like kind of been in a weird like filming slump lately like not really sure what to vlog and you know I go through these un un uninspiration uninspired and inspired waves i guess that's just kind of how life life goes obviously i don't want to feel i don't want to feel like my content's being forced to you guys so let me know do you like these kind of like miscellaneous weekend week in my life vlogs that are kind of a little all over the place do you like more of my sit down videos i just feel like kind of honestly like at a, a create like a content creator block yeah i don't know maybe it's just the way i'm feeling maybe it's my hormones it's that time of it's about to be that time of month so it could be a lot of things but anyways um if you've made it this far Thank you so much for being my people and sticking around and let me know if you have any requests for the, you know, the near future of content. I feel like I, I've done a lot of my requested content, at least like the Italian one, the Italian ones. Like I know a lot of you guys want more Italian vlogs, which I know I need to do, but I just, I also have a block on my Italian these days. Like I feel like I can't speak it. And then when I try to speak it, I just give up and get frustrated and that's not okay. I think it's just, I'm in a weird rut but hey, it happens. So let me know down below in the comments what you'd like to see more of. If you do like the vlogs, what do you want more of? Like, do you like the food? Do you like just randomness, chatty, get ready with me type of vlogs? And what kind of sit down videos? I know a lot of you are here for the, you know, cross-cultural Italian American content and I would love your help. And like, what topics would you like me to do or talk about? Um, I would really, appreciate hearing from you guys obviously at the end of the day like this is your channel as much as it is mine and i want to be able to be putting out content that you also want so yeah um but before i conclude and and end and say good night to you guys we got home to a lovely package i was having the sunday scaries it's just one of those 
off days and this definitely cured my Sunday scaries. So let me just show you guys. So I opened up this package and I'm just, I'm so excited. We've got Little Secrets Chocolate Pieces Peanut Butter and Dark Chocolate. If you guys have not tried these, literally put everything you're doing down and find where you can get these. I got my first bag I found at Whole Foods and basically it's like, I love sharing optional because I literally could eat a whole pack of these. It's like a healthy version. I say healthy because I mean, you know, it's, it's sweets. It's not that healthy for you, but it's the more healthier version of Reese's Pieces peanut butter because all the colorings from natural sources and it's dark chocolate rather than milk chocolate. I was obsessed with these and was posting it on Instagram and then they ended up sending me all of the stuff. So I've only tried these, but they sent me the mini crispy wafers, milk, oh, milk chocolate with sea salt. These look really good. This one looks really, really good. Dark chocolate with salted caramel. Oh, so thank you so much to Little Secrets for sending me this nice, kind care package for helping, helping me cure my Sunday scaries. How do you guys help get rid of your Sunday scaries before the crazy week ahead? Um, let me know down below in the comments. Anyways, that is going to be it for me this weekend. Thanks so much for clicking on this video and for being here. And until my, oh, and if you aren't already, please don't forget to subscribe to my channel. That way you don't miss out any of the videos that I put out in the future. And until next time, ciao.